Meet Daisy, she's got a way of making beautiful things. You never know what nature will teach her, what inspiration will bring. D-O-Y, D-O-Y, Daisy, what are we making today? D-O-Y, D-O-Y, Daisy, I bet we'll make something great. Hello there, Gumboot Kids. Hi, Daisy. This morning, I lay in bed listening to the wind blowing in the trees. Have you ever listened to the wind? The wind inspired me to make a nature craft. Would you like to make a forest mobile gumboot kids? Yay! <laughs> Step one, head outside and collect some treasures. Only collect what is plentiful, like leaves, acorns, chestnuts, and bark from the forest floor. Oh, I like this. Collect things that you think are special or beautiful. Found some pine cones. Great! Step two, choose a stick that is about the length of your arm. This will do. Perfecto! Tie some string or yarn to each end. This is where you're going to hang your nature treasures from. <laughs> I like pink thread. <laughs> Good job! Step three. Thread the string through your forest treasures. Ask an adult to help if you need to tie or put holes through some of the treasures. Here, I'll help you. Tie this piece on like this. You did a good job. Great teamwork, Gumboot Kids. You can also use beads and other special things you find in your craft supplies, like bells that will jingle in the wind. I like the bells a lot. Have fun. Use your imagination. There's no right or wrong way to make a nature craft. Okay, Gumboot Kids, let's see what you've made. It looks beautiful. The pine cones are cool. You are all so crafty. I think this creation is gonna look pretty great hanging from Scout's old cedar. See you later, Gumboot Kids. Goodbye, Daisy.